Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Aquarius? This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whenever you come to this channel. Hope everyone is staying safe. How's, how are y'all doing, Aquarius? I love you guys. Happy Saturday. I hope you had a good week. I want to say thank you all for your support, your like, and sharing. Please make sure you just watch my video all the way through to help support my channels. I really appreciate it. I love you guys. <clears throat> to new viewers, cross watchers, come on in, take what resonates, okay? Leave the rest for someone else and apply the gender roles how they fit in your life. So, Aquarius, have you been keeping your vibration up, your energy? Okay, let's see what's going on. Spirit guides, this is for Aquarius. What's the vibration for Aquarius? Thank you, Spirit guides. <clears throat> what's the vibration you have for Aquarius? This is for Aquarius. Okay, thank you, Spirit guides. For Aquarius. Okay, this card. All right. A new focus. Okay, Aquarius. Let me make sure I got that. Okay. Make sure I got this right, y'all. Okay. A new focus. I'm not going to read all of this, Aquarius. I'm going to proofread it. It says, uh, Spirit Guides, it says, if you are unhappy with a job or a relationship in your body, Spirit is saying to, to shift your focus. Like, for example, if you if you really, um, you're at work and, you, and you, you, it says, I really like to filter water at work or make it, or make it uh, whatever that is not going right in your life spirit wants you to change your focus on it and and, and see it differently change your perspective okay uh, in other words it's saying it is so great that my legs can carry me around town so you can you can you know kind of Snapchat this and read this to yourself, but it's like, you know, wherever you have doubt at spirit guides is saying to shift your perspective on how you see things. Okay. Have a new focus. All right. That's your vibration. Aquarius. Okay. Spirit guides. Another card for Aquarius vibration. Okay. That card went way over there, Aquarius. And I don't think I can get it. So I do another one. Okay. Thank you. Your other card is complain, refrain. Okay, not only spirit guides is saying it's time to have a new focus. Okay, um, and 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 with the new focus, it says, uh, for example, it makes me happy that my partner takes out the trash. Or when you focus on things you like, you change your body response. So also, you have the vibration of refrain from complaining. Okay, um, spirit is saying even if you had a traffic light, you know, you know, try not to get uh, frustrated and try, you know, just say, well, you know what, I have enough of time to, you know, listen to my song, you know. Or, or whatever it is. You can also Snapchat this as, as well. So Spirit is saying refrain from complaining and, and change your perspective on how you see things, okay, with your vibration, okay? So I have it here so you can Snapchat that, all right? So let's see where your energy is at, Aquarius. Spirit guides, this is for Aquarius. Where is Aquarius energy? What's Aquarius? I don't know why I said where is it. <laughs> what is Aquarius energy? Thank you, Spirit guides. This is for Aquarius. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Spirit guides. Okay. So I feel like a lot of you are holding yourself back. This is the garden and the gate. I feel like some of you could be holding yourself back. You're like, you know, uh, uh, maybe afraid to get out there into that big world. Uh, some of you can be shy. You can be a little timid. OK, but this is the gate, the garden and the gate. If you just have confidence and get outside of here and see what this whole world has to offer you. OK, um, start with a new focus, changing your perspective on things. OK, spirit is trying to get your attention. I also feel like uh, some of you need to continue to meditate, going to your to your your space, wherever you dwell in, whatever you meditate, because the spirit guides are there. Uh, some of you may need to go into your temple path, you know, go to yourself and pray to yourself, to your gods or whoever you pray to. Okay. 
and the spirits are there. I also feel like a lot of you or some of you can be very vulnerable right now. Out off, you could be out of balance. Okay, uh, you, you're you're out of alignment. Okay, um, and that's very important because when you're out of alignment, uh, you can't focus. Okay, there needs to be some balance. Okay. You're also doing a lot of thinking. Um, you're trying to, you're thinking about doing something. Maybe some of you could be going back to school, but you really are on a new path. You're trying to transition yourself uh, with yourself, okay? You, you're thinking of something, an ideal, okay? To get yourself back in balance, okay? Um, let's see. Spirit guys, tell me more. Any other energy for Aquarius? Any other energy, okay, that wanted to come out? Um, I feel as though that you, uh, I feel as though that you, you have a lot of options, a lot of doors here, but the main thing is that, um, you have adjusted possibilities, okay, or you don't believe that you have a lot of options because the card came out in reverse. I feel as though that you're thinking that you don't have a lot of options, but you have to, yeah, you have to uh, believe in yourself. Aquarius. Okay. Yeah. This is what I wanted to see. The door to spirit, the spirit guys is trying to get your attention. God, divine universe, whoever you believe in is trying to get your attention because the spirit guys is right there to help open up doors for you. But I feel like you need to go back into your meditation state and pray, pray or uh, meditate because clearly the divine wants to help you, um, to, you know, regain some confidence that you're lacking in. Okay. And, um, yeah, the magician in the mirror, um, some of you have done a lot of, a lot of, uh, shadow work, but also I feel as though that you can manifest anything you want. You have to look in that mirror. You have to believe in yourself. I intuitively feel as though that some of you don't have a lot of confidence in yourself, but you have to look in that mirror. You have to believe in yourself and the door to spirit, because look at you, you are a goddess. You are a beautiful soul. Okay. You, this is what people see when they see you. All right. And this is a beautiful thing. You are a goddess. All right. It's time to take action. Spirit guys is saying it's time to take action. Uh, uh, action. A lot of you are taking action. You're you're letting go of attachments, things that could be holding you back. OK, at one point in time, this could be in you not wanting to take that chance of being afraid. But I feel like a lot of you have really came a long way and let go of some things that you were dealing with within your own self. OK, and you're beginning to shed off some attachments that you know, held you back, okay, that made you be in a vulnerable state, okay, to make you not have enough of confidence in yourself, and I feel as though that you're doing good, you, uh, uh, some of you are taking action, you're going forward, uh, you're beginning to do, to see yourself, to see your worth, okay, you, you see yourself as a goddess, all right, but I also feel as though there's someone in your energy. Uh, someone can be uh, down the street, across the street, that's envious of what you have. And like I tell people, people have no clue of, 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 of what someone has. They on the outside looking out, look, looking in. But this came into the energy, Aquarius, that someone in your proximity, uh, down the street, across the street, uh, they're looking at their window and they're envious of what you have. Now, mind you that this person is coming from a very dark, dark place. Okay. And they're only projecting, they're projecting what you have. They're projecting evilness to you. Uh, spirit guys is saying some of somebody needs to wear evil eye, a uh, evil eye necklace or bracelet or something because people can project evilness towards you and, and that can come up on you. Okay. So I also see you have a blossom and abundance coming into your life. The spirit guys is coming towards you. Doors are about to open up for you, Aquarius. You have to believe it. You have to, whatever it is that you want, you have to go within your own 
temple place, your own meditation place, and ask spirit guides, because spirit guides is here. They are actually opening up doors as we speak, and you don't realize it. It's just that your mouth, your words have power, and spirit guides want you to speak and believe that whatever it is for some of you, if you want to go back to school, if you're thinking about writing a book, whatever you think, you got to continue to believe in yourself, have, um, have confidence in yourself, and have a new focus. You know, change your perception on how you see things, okay? Spirit also wants you to refrain from complaining. Or you find yourself complaining, turn it into something positive, okay? Yeah, you hate all the traffic lights, but hey, I can listen to my my song. Oh, it's raining. And you like you can say, Oh, I wish I look forward to when it stops raining. You know, change your perspective of how you see things. Okay. In the energy, I feel like some of you are dealing with some financial constraint, but that is about to be over, okay? I feel like some of you are worried about something, okay? You're depressed, you're worried about something. Um, don't worry because you have the blossom and abundance coming in your life and it's right here. The spirit, guys, is about to open up some doors for you. You are about to get a blessing, okay? That is a very beautiful card. Spirit, guys, also say stop worrying, OK, have a new focus, change your perspective. Things are about to get better. All right. So let's see what's in the stars for you, Aquarius. Spirit guides, what's in the stars for Aquarius? Thank you, Spirit. Change your perspective. It's time for a new focus, Aquarius. Thank you, Spirit guides. This is for Aquarius. OK, so you says following your path. Following the path of another, your path is being redirected to where it should be. OK, so spirit guides is redirecting your path. I know sometimes it's like we feel like a path the way we're going is best for us. But spirit guides, divine God say, no, you don't want to go that way. You know how when you're driving and you come up on a detour and it's like, no, you got to go the other way. That's what spirit got, because if you keep forward, you're going to miss your blessing. That's what spirit guides said. If you keep going straight in the direction that you want to go in, you're going to miss your blessing. You're going to miss this blossom and blessing that's coming towards you. So spirit is redirecting your path because there's something else that spirit guys has for you that's better for you. Okay, Aquarius, that is for somebody. Okay, spirit is redirecting your path. So let's see what the angels and ancestors has to say. Okay, spirit guys, this is for, okay, thank you. This is for Aquarius. All right, you are the high priestess. I told you, you're the high priestess, you're the goddess. You are, you have so much power. You have more power than you realize it, okay? You can manifest anything you want. You just have to believe it. You have to work it. Thank you, Spirit Guys. You have to work it, all right? So let's see with the um <clears throat> with the fortune telling deck. Let's see what Spirit Guys have for you, Aquarius. Thank you, Spirit Guys. This is for Aquarius. All right, let's see what spirit guides have for you, Aquarius. This is for Aquarius. Thank you, spirit guides. This is for Aquarius. <clears throat> Thank you. This is for Aquarius. Let's see what spirit guides have for you. That card. There's a message coming in. Okay, Aquarius, you're going to have a message through maybe a text, ma text message or email that's coming in for you, okay? You're getting ready to get a message. Thank you. It's going to be about a house, okay? Um, it could be about some type of house. A message is coming in. It's, it could be about your house. Maybe some of you wanting a house. You put in for a house. Or it's about your house, okay? But you have a false person that's in the presence, okay? Someone is false, okay? Spirit, tell me more. Tell me more, spirit, guys. You have someone that's false. Thank you, spirit. What other message? Okay. Um, 
Um, I also feel like you're definitely coming out. OK, you've been going through a trans transformation, transitioning. You see all those butterflies. This is a pathway. You're you're about to come into the sunshine. You're about to get your that's why spirit guys is putting you is redirecting your path. OK, because maybe something down the road that you didn't see was someone that was going to falsely deceive you. OK, and spirit guides protects us. Right. That's why. My spirit is saying your path is being redirected uh, where it should be because you were headed down the wrong road. My goodness, you were headed down the wrong road. I'm just here to tell you the message. OK, spirit guides had to redirect you. If you wonder why things happen the way it is happening, because you had to be redirected. There was something false, something deceiving that was coming from someone and spirit had to had to redirect you uh to somewhere else okay um so spirit guys tell me more <clears throat> tell me more spirit guys thank you oh let's see if i can get that job so we got a marriage here okay we have a marriage here. Some of you are going to get a message about a house, okay, a marriage. Uh, I also feel as though that for some of you, you're about to get, you, you're going to get married. You're going to get a house. Some of you might have put in a loan for about, about a house or something, um, and you're being redirected. Or this message can be pertaining to someone you was married to. OK, about a house and then you're going to get some kind of email or message about it. That's a different energy. But a lot of you have been redirected because there was a false person that was about to interrupt, about to try to do something uh, sneaky to maybe try to. Uh, deceive you some kind of way, but that's why divine, you're divinely protected. That's why you have been redirected and in your path, you're about to go right. The spirit divine universe is about to, uh, redirect you in, in, in the phase of, uh, abundance. Okay. That's why I say sometimes detours, sometimes we don't understand why we go through things, but sometimes it's for our protection because the divine universe see things before we can see them and we don't understand. But that's why if you wonder why things have changed or something didn't pan out like you wanted it to, that's because you have been redirected. OK, so, yeah, because, you, you know, and I feel like some of you are going to follow your heart. But not only that, you are the queen of cups. You're very nourishing, very caring. You have a very beautiful soul and, and you care about people. OK, that's why the, you are divinely protected, because you have nothing but spirits in here redirecting your life because you have someone that did not. That's right. You know, right somewhere being sneaky and deceiving and. um a false person that you may be interacting with was maybe trying to trying to. I feel as though that they, this person could have been trying to do something about a house or maybe interrupt you with a house, try to do something sneaky. But the divine universe got control of that and protecting you because he sees you as a very nourishing, a very caring person. OK, our spirit guys watch over us. OK. Our spirit guys watch over and protect us. Believe that. Yeah, I feel as though that you're about to cele celebrate. You also um, at one point in time felt left out in a cold by someone, but you're about to celebrate. OK, you're about to celebrate with your friends and your family Aquarius. OK. All right. So, <clears throat> yeah, you have some deceivingness. Someone hiding, who had been stealing, hiding from you, deceiving a woman or a man. Someone's falsely um, hiding, okay? But um, don't worry about it. You are divinely protected. That's why spirit guides have redirected you, okay? Because when, they, when the spirit guides, the divine God redirected you, you are about to go into your blossom. You're about to walk. Here it is right here, the pathway. 
you're about to walk right. It had to turn you around because you was headed for, excuse me, you were headed for destruction. You were headed for something that was going to come against you. And spirit guides had to redirect you on your path and you're because you're coming out of this transformation you've you've done a lot of work on yourself and you have changed and you're about to see the light so don't get discouraged when you're like why didn't that happen or why didn't this because god and divine knows and see things before you do so cover your ears and i'm going to see if any of these charms is significant to your reading okay thank you spirit guys all right so you got, okay, you got, um, you have a Taurus. Taurus might be significant to some of you. You have, uh, somebody might like softball. You have a dragonfly. I think that's what that is, a dragonfly. Okay, you have a lock. Okay, there's a lock here. This could be significant to someone, a lock. Um, you have... A lot of transformation, transformation. You also have a rose. Someone may be giving someone a rose, a flower, but you definitely have two butterflies. So that's a lot of transformation. Listen, I am so proud of you that God divine has redirected your path because you're about to walk right into abundance. I love you guys. Until next time.